Hey, what's up, guys? How you doing today? We're here in Cornella at our Wild West County Fire Department. How you doing today, folks? It's a great day. Hey, if you haven't already, hit that like button and subscribe if you want to see more content from me. Anyways, I hope everyone's having a great day. It's a great day here, so I want to get to showing you our new fire department here in Coronella. And there, there's our office in our uh, door. Is it working correctly right now? So, but yeah, here's a couple of our rescue vehicles. Uh, let's open this door. We'll come back around here to these. Uh, but I mean, we'll give them a quick glimpse. Our six wheeler here, um, our, our lifted uh, Polaris, and uh, I think it's a Yamaha or another Polaris. I'm sorry. Uh, but yeah, those are uh, some nice rescue uh, addition or vehicle additions that we have. Uh, here's that Chiefs uh, Corvette. Uh, this thing is so fast. Uh, it's it's pretty gangster. Yeah, it's nice. But yeah, he parks it right in front. We got another little utility, little put Polaris, our utility trailer that we fit our rescue vehicles in and a nice little patio area for us to barbecue, relax when we're not out putting out fires. And right here, this is a brand new little uh, utility vehicle. Uh, the, the, the service uh, guys, they just dropped it off the other day. But uh, right here, we got a, uh, the Battalion Chiefs, you know, brand new um, SUV. Um, a Chevy, obviously. But um, yeah, it's a nice little, uh, it's a nice little SUV. Um, so yeah, this is what the, the battalion chief drives around when, he, uh, when he's out and about. He's out doing whatever he needs to do and whatever he needs to take care of. Uh, so, uh, but yeah, I know that the chief definitely uh, likes this thing. He definitely drives it around a lot more than his, uh, his car. <laughs> Sometimes they'll just leave the car, but uh, but yeah, we're not gonna get too into depth with all these vehicles because um, I just want to sh mainly show you the build, the the fire department, you know. But we'll get into, I guess we'll show you, you know, the vehicles, but we're not gonna get in them all and start all. Uh, this is one of my buddies. Uh, that's his Dodge. Uh, this is another one of the guys. This is, uh, uh, his Chevy. So, uh, yeah, dude, this is a really nice blazer. He's got it hooked up and it's lifted. Uh, nice F-350. Uh, I think it's a 99 or something like that, 98. But, um, yeah, it's nice. He's got a nice little setup on it. But uh, there's a few more uh, vehicles, but they're gone. They're, they went to lunch, so they'll be back. And, uh, but, eh, let's start over here. Hey, where's he at? Where's Spot? Oh, there he is. Hey, what's up, dude? Haha. <laughs> he come running around. There he is. He wants a belly rub. See? Yeah, he wants a belly rub. Oh, let's scratch it. Hey, good boy. Good boy. Nice. Alright. And there's our, some of our vehicles. We'll start off with these two. Uh, these two are. Um, of our ambulances right here this is the international um it's a uh, it's this is our bigger ambulance um uh, if you ask me it's it's a little bit better it's nicer it's bigger uh, right here this is a dodge it's the same thing pretty much gets your job done um it's just a little bit smaller a little less powerful than uh than the international um but they're definitely both nice to have here at this, the station um and we definitely use them and uh but yeah this is a, here's a tanker uh, we got a nice tanker i think it fills 15 15 000 gallons i don't know uh, i think so but there's our can-am our nice little utility vehicle and the ladder one this is uh this is our pride and joy and this is an this is a nice 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 truck and we'll have to get in we'll get in we'll show you guys this one even if we don't show you our number two right there, our number three ladder, we'll show you our, our, for our number one. It's a nice another little Can-Am off-road uh, rescue vehicle. Uh, but yeah, our, this is, that's ladder three. Um, she's, you know, it's not huge, but uh, it definitely gets the job done. You know? And, uh, but yeah, here, I guess we'll go and uh, we'll show you guys the, the interaction. Uh, let's, let's, 
side. Pull out, first. Right, pull out the doors. Uh, just tie the green touch. Alright, so let's get the side. right yeah that's a nice little setup guys all right that's not too bad right like I said uh, the Dodge does the same thing it's just a little bit smaller so this we would use I don't know a little bigger operation well, we like using the International but we do use the Dodge and the spot is being weirdo running into the corner we have our gas right there our water was to the left there we feel fill up our water and our fuel and then uh, there's our uh, washer and our compressor there's our ladder two and a rescue truck but we'll get into ladder one right now let's get in ladder one I want to show you guys inside this beast oh check this out man is that nice we'll start her up dude this thing is so it's just, it's a beast this game's But we're not going to worry about that right now because we just kind of wanted to show it to you. I want to show you guys what we got going on here in Cornella, Wild West County. All right, we'll show you. Uh, all right, well, here's this is a little tool area. We keep our tools up here. We have a uh, this is where a sleep area and that like room with nothing that was just. Um, the storage area we don't have anything in uh, and then right here we have one of our attack trucks right here uh, it hey man that thing's a beauty I, I like personally I like the Ford one a little better it's it I know it's older but to me it looks better and um, you know I, I really enjoy that one we've had it for a long time and uh, you know she's tried and true but this Dodge definitely does the trick I guess we'll I'll show you how these little attack trucks, the brush trucks work. Uh, we won't get into both of them. I'll just show you this dodge here. Uh, but give you an idea. I think the Ford works the same way. But yeah, lights work. The sirens, this opens up. It has all that extra stuff. Uh, uh, fire extinguishers, hoses, tools. Uh, uh, stuff that evacuate people from an area. Absolutely. So like I said, all of our, all of our extra stuff we can do a good job. Uh, but yeah. And also, it, it, is, it is a good uh, margin. So, here is this one, and now we do water. I think I'm going to use the tank. And there we go. Ooh, she works good. And that O's is actually long. It's pretty long. But you get the idea. Not too bad. Not too bad, right guys? It's a nice little it's a nice little town, man. It's definitely a nice place to be. Uh, like I said, those are our rescue vehicles, like the six wheeler, Polaris, and uh, uh, I forget what the other one is. Uh, but yeah, here's our rescue truck. This one just has our tools. Um, this one doesn't have a tank. It doesn't have any. Uh, it has some extra hoses in it, but for the four other trucks, we can tow things with it. It, it does have sirens. They do light up, um, but um, it's not. It, it doesn't have you know any like you know. It doesn't have a pump. It doesn't have anything like that. So, but it definitely helps out having it. And then here's ladder two. 
and it's a little bit smaller than ladder one it's not quite as nice but um, as you can see there's 20,000 uh, gallons of, in the tanks uh, of water so um, it definitely helps to, to have them both and we I don't think we've ever had to take them both on a job before um, but uh, you never know it could happen it's possible right all right like I said, nice little can now. Huh? Hey, what's up, bud? Oh. Yes, I know, you want your belly rubbed. Belly rubs, belly rubs. All right, all right, buddy. All right, guys. So like I said, nice little patio area. We come and hang out over here. We barbecue all the time. And then, like I said, this new little um, utility vehicle, uh, and this is also, um, was uh, brought in by the, our service station here. You guys have probably seen it, uh, seen them, uh, seen those guys, and uh, that Cornell uh, service station. Uh, but yeah, they dropped this guys. We we bought this and we asked them to drop it off here. But I wanted to show you. We have another area over here, and I wanted to show you this area. Um, it's it's kind of a, a newer build for us. Uh, uh, we put in these paper stones uh, they go down the other way but I want to show you right here first because this is a new it's a new part of our uh, station it's a new addition we got our, our helipad with our rescue and uh, rescue uh, heli uh, uh, chopper so uh, right now the team is in there I think they're they're cleaning their gear they're and they're doing their daily uh, their daily checks so that way they're ready to go when they need to be so I'm, I'm gonna let them do their thing. I'm gonna come down here and show you this one, this this last little area we have right now at uh, the property. But we just haven't done anything with it yet. Uh, like I said, it's it's a nice it's a nice big slab. There's a couple little you know storage little the parts of things under, but nothing really yet. I don't know why are you guys you know leave some in the comments. Let me know you guys. Uh, we'll come back here, here spot running around. Yeah. Nice day. But, we'll park this bad boy right here. We'll park this bad boy right here. And we'll uh you know it's such a nice day, but uh you know what? I think we're gonna have to probably uh, call it a day. And why don't you guys let me know what you guys want to see uh, see us doing here later. We can go on a rescue. If, I don't know. We'll go help some people out. I know there's some campers that always need help. But hey, thank you guys for tuning in to Beam Kings Gaming. And, and uh, watching my videos. Remember to hit that like button and subscribe for more content. Thank you guys.